Free for all. So here I am in the theater, the and it's hijacked again. Um, free for all, and whenever I play free for all, it seems like I am always stuck on hijacked. I never get to do very many other maps. It's it's be either I play hijacked or the uh, lobby kind of falls off. I, I say this game because it's the uh, first time I came close in, to, to getting a nuclear medal, and and I've never done that on this game. Um, in a free for all, and I never done it in the regular uh, game either. But I'm gonna take my my death right there, and I'm gonna go on a tear. As you can see, I'm two uh, two kills, one death, so I can't uh, do a nuclear anymore. But uh, I'm gonna run on a tear, and, and how I do it is um, just doing something I, I used to never ever do, and that would be camp. Um, I've kind of changed my ways, uh, having been exposed to the bad side of the lag in this game. I came back with the opinion that, uh, you know, sometimes you just need to take it easy, you know, let the game kind of come to you. I'm used to, I was used to running around a little bit more and trying to be a super mega rusher, but that didn't work out for me um, so well. You can die. There you go. But it didn't work out for me, and, um, you know, I should have probably died that right there. If that guy could shoot that uh, LMG he's spraying, he would have had me. But I changed my ways. Like I said, I got off uh, got off track right away. I don't uh, do a script. I'm just rambling. But I, I put claymores down, and I just use low kill streaks, and it seems to always be more than enough to roll a lobby of a free for all. Not very many people use ghost. You know, this guy could have uh, benefited from it. But you know, I'm gonna throw this. Uh, Hunter killer down and throw it right into the spawn and it's always going to kill someone. And because it's free for all, there's always somebody who is not running uh, blind eye. Some people might have flak jacket on, but uh, more people need to use things like um, guardian ready to deploy. You know the sit rep. You know whatever that would be because I'm setting up to camp and I'm not going to move out of this room. I'm going to be a little shit heel. I'm going to put my claymores down. I'm going to throw guardians. I'm gonna grab this guy's DSR and I'm gonna shoot people in the spawn, and that's okay because they're not gonna stop me. You know what I'm doing is very easy to counter, but uh, these guys don't seem to want to do what's necessary. You know I'm gonna let them tell me they're coming, and I'm gonna go ahead and chase him down. Get myself another claymore, and keep doing the same thing. Throw it down on the stairs this time. Oh, there you go. Mr. Sniper came up after me after I didn't try to shoot him. Waiting orders. He spawned down at the bottom, but I didn't uh, feel like using his suppressed DSR-50. I'll pick it up and uh, do some things with it a little bit later, but at that time I didn't feel like trying to trade uh, shots. Let's see, here we go. Nope. Anyway, I was kind of just letting him, up, letting him know that I'm up there. Shooting at him a little bit and uh, seeing if I can get someone to uh, poke their head out and stand still long enough for me to hit him. Killer drone on yeah, there's the Merciless. Well, I'm still rolling. Someone just shot me from the spawn, but I'm gonna go right back up and see if he follows me. He got through. Now I got another Guardian. Guess where it's going? At the other entrance. And these things last forever. I mean, the streaks and ghosts, they kind of time out really quickly. But the ones from Black Ops 2, you know, you pretty much, you gotta dispatch them. Or they're gonna stick around. You know, the sentry guns last a pretty long time, the guardians last a pretty long time. I, I don't know if there's an actual time limit, but uh, before this map is over, I have three and a fourth one on deck. There you go. Backfire your weapon. And it's gonna keep doing the same thing. You know, no one's going to come up here. They're not willing to EMP me, and they're not uh, willing to throw grenades. And uh, I watched this game in theater, and I was looking at some of the perspective of what the people who were facing me were doing. And they were they were looking up and seeing all my red, and they were just running away. You know, like, I'm not even going to try. I'm not going to try to get that guy. I'm just going to let him go and, you know, let someone else deal with it. You know, bring in an EMP class. There's nothing wrong with it. You, if you want to see... Uh, you know, see your um, opponents just sit here and make it impossible for you to touch them, throw an EMP down. I mean, you'd get yourself 400 points with what I have there. There you are. 
I got nervous right there because I took a, quite a bit of damage, but um, whatever it was, I, I survived, and that's okay. So, like I said, uh, normally this free for alls, I don't really take them all too seriously, you know, but uh, I had fun with this one. You know, it's a. Uh, I, I usually don't get that high of streak. I usually will hit tens. You know, get a merciless and call it enough because most people. Oh, that guy should have killed me. Look at that theater. He should have killed me. He's uh, he's spraying that S12 or whatever that shotgun is. And not today, sir. Oh God, I bet you that that was embarrassing for him. That sniper was sitting on top of that other deck, and I threw the. Uh, Killer drone and hit him right in the face. The walls on this map, particularly, are very soft. I'm not even using full metal jackets. See, there's my third guardian, and all three of them are still running. They're very, th they're very thin walls on this map, and uh, I'm not even using full metal jacket like I was trying to say. And then um, nothing, you know, stops the bullets. You, know, I, that guy, I just shot him right through the railing without really seeing very much of him, and it was enough to get me a kill. And there you go, sir. Another Claymore. And said so these guys, they're just not even, they're not even trying. They're letting me do whatever I want to do. And there's my, my Guardian's done right there. But uh, so, someone followed me and he ran right into the Claymore. You know? And there's the other Claymore, so that's the back side. So maybe they're finally getting frustrated with me. But uh, a, lot, a lot of red dots everywhere and they're still not getting me. Let's see what I can do pick up this uh, yeah see he tried to he's finally trying to shoot me with something that was a rocket but you know again it's a small he should be throwing a grenade or an EMP at me see he's trying to small me and then you know now I put him in my highlight reel Hunter killer gonna get me another one Hostile UAV above. Let's see where we at. 26 and 2. Look at those connections. All terrible. See, someone would shoot me through the wall there, and again, this map is so thin. Oh, that guy should have killed me. This map is so thin. Uh, the, the penetration on it is so thin that you can just do whatever you want. And, you know, hang him up on the Guardian there. There you go. Hang him up in the Guardian. I'm giving him a different look, if you if you didn't catch on to what I was doing. They've seen me upstairs now for the majority of the map, so now I'm seeing if I can't bait him to... Uh, get in. Here I get kind of a, a little cheeky and try to get him... Uh, see, so I got one of them, but not the, the second, and um, just trying to finish it off and get the... Uh, was it the, What's the one that's 25? But whatever it is. I didn't get it, but I hit a 27 streak in a free-for-all, and I'll take it any day. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks.